Yo, what is up my legendary subscribers? This is Nintendo Gamer Legend. Today I've got a no face cam video, so that means that it's pretty much different from my other videos. Um, I want to see if you guys like it because I haven't really been getting a lot of feedback from my face cam videos. Plus, I tend to do a lot better when it's just a mic and a headset. So, um, maybe I'll just stop using the webcam for right now. But, I'll try something new as we take a look at these possible Final Evolution leaks for Rowlet and, it's, uh, and Litten and Poplio. So, why don't we get started into today's video right now. So, first off, right here. Let me extend the frame a little bit. Uh, yeah. We have Rowlet's possible final evolution. Now, it does still look like it's going to be grass flying, as it does look like a grass flying type for sure. It looks like an owl slash, you know, kind of like eagle-ish Pokemon. Definitely more like an owl. And it also looks like kind of like Robin Hood, if you guys have ever heard the story of Robin Hood. Um, he's an archer, as you guys can see right here. Um... In this image right down here it looks much more smaller right in this image right here I can't really read Japanese but if you could see right here on like its wings it's kind of like his like his ammunition right here you got um, arrows and then right here you got his bow right on his arm um, as he curves his kind of like his wings as he pulls back an arrow at his opponents maybe that could be a signature move I'm not sure um, it definitely looks really cool. I um, mean, it has a hood. This is why I really want to choose Rowlet because if this is his final evolution, it'd be much more cooler. I think it would be as tall as Charizard or maybe like four feet. It's definitely going to have the grass flying type. Or maybe who knows? Maybe it's just going to have me like a grass fighting type. I'm not sure, but it's probably grass flying. So as you guys can see right here, it's a very cool image. If you got this is probably my favorite out of three besides Poplio's. So why don't we get um, moving into the next one, which is Litten's um, Final Evolution. So this Pokemon is very controversial, not because of its looks, but because of how it looks to be a fire fighting type. And we all know how you know kind of hated the fire fighting type for starter Pokemon is, but it actually probably could not be probably could be a dark type as well. I want to talk about something very brief here. I think we could see Ash in his Pikachu. Um, I don't know if it's just, just maybe just like a fake image. Maybe this could all just be fake, but it does really look pr pretty legit. I mean, you guys can see. I don't know. It just really looks legit to me. I do like this design. I do like him. He looks really cool. Um, I think it's going to be Fire Dark or Fire Poison. If you guys can see right here, he's spitting sort of like, I don't know, like a poisonous hairball. Kind of like Litten is shooting a fiery hairball. So maybe it's going to be a Fire Poison type. Doesn't really look like it, but actually maybe it can be a more of a Fire Dark type. Because you could see more Dark types are basically with... A color scheme of red and kind of like red with fire and evil, kind of like blood. Um, grays and blacks um, look very menacing and dark. I just think it looks awesome, as you can see. It does look like a cat. I mean, it is standing on its hind legs, but it does look very adorable. It looks like it's going to be a wrestler Pokemon, so definitely is on the horizon to be a fire-fighting Pokemon, which I really hope it's not because, honestly, we have two, three, two awesome Firefighting types, we have Infernape, and then we have Blaziken. Um, Embor is not that great, but definitely looks better than Embor. I think it's a, one of the greatest, greater looking Final Evolutions for, you know, like Tepig, you know, went to become a Pig Knight and Embor. And, but this just looks 10 times more cooler. But as you can see, it does look cool. Um, I don't know if this is Ash. It does look like Ash, because you can see from like the spikes on his hair and the Pikachu. So maybe he's going to catch a Litten in the, in the region. I'm not sure. In the Alola region. It could be possible. But why don't we move on to the final one. Which is Poppio's final evolution. Or possible final evolution. Now I did say in the last video. That I might choose Litten. But honestly. I cannot get over this design. And how beautiful and elegant this Pokemon is. It does look a little bit feminine. But it definitely looks like. Kind of like a siren. You guys have ever heard of sirens. Um, they're like mystical sea creatures that control. I, I, I'm not sure. I read the Odyssey in school this year, so it does look like a mermaid too. I mean, I guess you could say, but 
As you can see right here, this Pokemon looks very elegant. You can see it's definitely probably like a maybe like a, a water fairy type or a water psychic type. That looks a water psychic type would be awesome. As you can see, you know, kind of like how it's like doing this dance. Um, it could be like a um, a psychic sort of like move using psychic standing up. Um, I like how it looks. It looks like an official Pokemon. I, I, I am just so hooked on these final evolutions, and I am hoping that they are real, because these look awesome. They look absolutely legit. This Pokemon is very graceful. It's beautiful. It's elegant. It looks awesome for a Populous final evolution, and if this is Populous final evolution, or does look similar to this, I am definitely choosing Poppyo. No regrets. I'm definitely choosing Poppyo for my starter Pokemon in Pokemon Sun and Moon. I just love, I'm in love with this design, guys. I, I don't know about you, but this is the best out of the bunch. I mean, all these look really great, as you can see. You know, they all look like really good final evolutions. This looks ten times better than Delphox. This is, Greninja's cool. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. And, of course, you got the Owl. I've always wanted an Owl as a starter Pokemon, so there you go. Um... But that's pretty much it for this video today, guys. Um, I'm sorry if I'm a little jitterish. I'm not sure. I'm just really used to the face cam videos. Oh, oh, you guys can see right here. It is the same thing. Um, you guys can see it all here. You could download the image for yourself. I'm going to leave a link to Tech Times so you guys can find this image and you can download it. Uh, but that's it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like if you guys like these the non-face cam videos and these cool Pokemon designs. I'll see you guys next time in the, in the next Pokemon Sun and Moon video. I'll see you guys next time. Remember, you guys, to coot me on, and I'll see you guys next time. Okay, so before I end the video, I just really want to say I want to thank everyone that's been sticking with me. I have been losing a lot of views, and that's okay because I haven't been on YouTube for a while. But I'm doing really good with the Pokemon videos, so I'm probably going to stick to that. I'm probably going to become a Poketuber. I thought I would make this at the end of the video. Um... But I really appreciate all you guys' support. Leave a comment. I'm just begging you guys. That's my only request. I, I just want to respond to you guys' comments. I don't even care if they're hate comments. I just really want some comments on my video so I can respond to my fans. Um, but yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Next time there's any Pokemon Sun and Moon related. I want to make a discussion video about no Megas. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, guys. Again. Okay.